Hey what's up you all filmmakers out there watching this video, I'm really glad to have you here in my YouTube channel, I'm Carlo with Viva Folk and if you are new in this channel try to consider subscribing. I'm pretty sure you will find very useful tips and tech reviews for you to improve your filmmaking skills and today I want to share with you 3 hacks on how to get smooth and stable shots to achieve the best cinematic mood in your films in just 2 minutes. But first, let's go with the intro. I know some of you have been in a lot of trouble while trying to make your footage more stable. Think about it, have you seen a shaky shot in a Hollywood film? Shaky shots never look professional, so you might be thinking how to get those shots without that expensive gear used in those movies. So here you have my first hack. My first and really cheap solution is using a book. It might sound weird but trust me, it really works. So you just need to find a smooth surface, put it in the top and hit it. There you have a beautiful and stable shot. Just keep in mind that you need to be focused on how fast or how slow are you sliding the book. So keep your movement smooth and this will really help while you don't have a gimbal or a steady cam. And my second hack is trying with the ninja walk. This is a very useful tip while following your character. Because when we walk we're generally moving without being careful with our body movements and this is gonna basically get this kind of shot. And as you can see, it looks shaky and unprofessional, so the ninja walk is based on a really easy heel toe technique. You just need to keep your knees a little bit flexed and try to step softly. Also using a wide angle lens will help your shot to look a lot more steady. I think normal lenses don't really perform the best while trying to shoot hand handled. But if you want to try with it, it's just fine. You just gotta be careful because it does introduce more shaky movements. And my third hack is using your camera strap. This could be your best friend for your next shooting days. It's very easy to carry, it's very light and it fits everywhere. So you will be basically your own tripod. You just need to attach the strap to your camera, put the strap around your neck and basically make tension holding the camera right in front of you and pushing your body back. This way you will have a lot more control with your camera movements, allowing you to get more stable shots. So those are my three hacks on how to get more stable footage actually without any money. And remember, you can always combine it using the stabilizer plugin in Premiere Pro. It's a great tool and it really help you to get your final shot a final touch. So that's all folks, if you have any other creative hack that you want to share with everybody out there filming or watching this video, write them down in the comments and stay tuned for the second part of this video. I will share some other creative hacks on how to get more stable shots and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, you will be able to find some of my lots and Lightroom presets, so hit the like button and see you the next time here in Viva Folk.